We are back at the gym on Park Avenue with fitness coach Marlo Ellis. Now Marlo, today we're doing something with a bar and a rack. Yeah, we're going to do three um, basic strength and muscle development movements. We're going to do some squatting, we're going to do some deadlifts, and we're going to do some chest press. Sounds right. like great fun because this bar weighs how much? This is about 45, this is about 60 pounds or so right. in here. Yay. You're good. Okay. A small child, so. Jen. All right, so I'm going to get back behind you. First, we're going to start off with squat. Okay, okay. I'd like you to step back. Okay, get your legs a little bit wider than shoulder width, head up. And you're okay. going to pick the bar up off the rack. 60 pound bar. Yep, okay. secure, secure your lower back. There you go. Okay. And step forward. Okay. You want to make sure that you're all set. Tighten up that back and hips out and down Thanks. toward me. So you're going to. There you go. Awesome. You want to make sure when you're doing squats that you're really focusing on pushing into the floor and keeping your core nice and tight, your head up, and good, strength, good strong legs and glutes. This is fantastic for leg development, glutes, lower back, core, the whole nine. Well, I can feel How it, are you doing? Pretty, I can feel it pretty much everywhere in my lower body. Can you? <laughs> okay. Awesome, Janice. So Marlo, now we're going to do deadlifts with a 60 pound bar. That's right. Now really? we're going to do some deadlifting. So the squatting was for basically the front of your body, for your quads, and then for your core, and also for your glutes. So now we're actually going to work on the back of your body. I'm going to have you pulling, and you're going to do some deadlifts, which will help with your hamstring, lower back, glute strength, OK? OK. So walk up to the bar. Mm -hmm. Feet shoulder width apart, toes nice and straight for this particular deadlift. OK, and what you're going to do, Jan, is you're going to keep your shoulders back. And I want you to hinge. Okay, keep the bar close to you, shoulders up, head up, and you're going to pull it straight up. Out it, girl. Nice. Okay, lower it, keep your eyes forward, and down. Um, excellent. You should feel that, Jan, in your lower back. I do. Hamstrings, yeah, feel good. It's normally a really nice stretch, um, the deadlift, but you have to make sure that they're done properly or they can compromise your lower back. A lot of injury happens from a deadlift that's either too heavy or not done properly. You want to have a nice straight back. And shoulders back. That's awesome, Janice. Good job. Now, how many, feel? how many of these should I be doing? Well, if, if you want to, for somebody like yourself, you want to do between eight and twelve reps. <laughs> Keep okay. going. You're at what? Two or three? <laughs> <laughs> well, we've taken some weight off, and Raindrop has come to help. That's so right. She's going to help you, now? Jan. Yeah. She'll, she'll pick up all the slack. <laughs> All right, so what we're going to do here is we're going to do a little upper body pushing. This is a chest press on a flat bench, okay? okay. You can do chest press at different um, planes, but for this one, we'll have you on the flat bench. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove <laughs> the excess. Okay. All right, and you're going to slide down. Raindrops down. Excellent. Okay, so what you want to do here, John, is you're just going to push the bar straight up and then bring it out and then straight down, okay? And what you're doing is you're pushing from your chest. You really want to focus on using your chest. Keep your core nice and tight. You can use your feet if you need to uh, press so down. So I guess the hard part is actually keeping it far out. Yeah, and you want to keep it nice and straight. You don't want it to waver. You want to have a nice, even push. So this is <laughs> awesome chest development, which is often an area of weakness for women. So it's a really good, it's a really good movement for building upper body strength. Okay. So I think that's all I can okay. do. And Fantastic. I, How's that feel? That was good. I think that was our last one. Yeah, that was it. So, so we did uh, squats, squatting, deadlifts, yeah. and a chest press. That's all right. we're done with a 45 pound bar and, and, and a, a rack. bench. You don't bench. even have to have a rack. Yeah, you can do it. exactly. Okay. So good if job. You want, if you want any more information on anything that we've done today, you can contact Marlo through her website. And keep watching. We'll have more Body Sculpt with Marlo Ellis.